Hey, Aquarius, how's it going? I hope you guys are doing well. If this is your first time checking out Julie Devine's channel, what is up? I'm Amy. If you're returning, welcome back. So very interesting spread, to say the least, for you guys for the, the weeks of the 16th to the 30th. I know I'm a little late, but here we go. We have two angel cards for you guys. The first one says life purpose. The purpose of your life is to serve in a way that brings great joy to yourself and others. Don't worry about finding your purpose. Instead, focus upon serving a purpose and then your purpose will serve you. Perfect timing. Now is the perfect moment for you to act on your inspirations. The doors are open while you walk through them with us by your side. Don't delay or procrastinate. All of us are as all of the ingredients are ripped for your success. Everything and everyone is on your side, supporting your positive outcome. So, very interesting. Um, we have the Five of Cups coming up. We have the Hermit. Five of Swords. Eight of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles. Queen of Wands. Eight of Wands. The Chariot. Three of Cups and Ace of Swords, guys. So I don't know what's going on with you or why things are happening the way they are, but the messages that I'm getting for you, Aquarius, or that you guys are at a loss for something, you guys are feeling overwhelmed, you're feeling upset, you're feeling angry, you're feeling like all of these mixed emotions, you're feeling like you can't go on anymore, you're feeling... Um, some type of regret maybe about the past i feel um this is a time that whatever you are holding on to you really need to decide to let it go because it is no longer serving you i feel like um cool. it's you are kind of draining yourself you are kind of um making yourself really exhausted uh, mentally, emotionally, physically. Whatever the situation is, it definitely has you on your knees. Um, I, I just feel like you, you feel like you have no other options. You feel like you have no other offers. You don't see the good in this. You just see the bad. And um, you need to... Thank you. Do you want to sit in that chair? No. Sorry, guys. Um, you need to realize that everything happens for a reason. And the reason behind whatever this is that has you gone to your knees is that this is a lesson and test that God has for you. This is a lesson and test that spirit is saying, you know what, maybe you didn't learn it the first time and that's where we're letting you learn it a second time. Maybe um, you need to redo this lesson so you can um, start to understand um, because there is hope. There's birds in the background. There is hope. Whatever this is, it's, it's not going to stay. It's going to it's going to be over and done with before it even officially gets started, if that makes any sense. I feel like you're in this place right now where you just need to take so much needed time for yourself with the hermit. This is that time out. This is, you know, closing the door to anything that no longer serves you. This is closing the door to the things that are keeping you stuck, that are keeping you from moving forward, guys. This isn't a time to do the same patterns as before. This isn't a time to allow the same shit to be going on. This is you packing your bags and saying, you know what? I deserve better. I want better. I'm going to go get better. This is you looking at something from a better perspective. This is you, you know, again, just taking that time to really go within yourself and think about what it is that you guys want. That's, that's all it is, Aquarius, is that whatever this situation is, you really need to decide if it's worth this heartache, if it's worth this pain. Okay. Um... Because you are at a conflict. You are at a loss. You feel like, you know, you just need to pick your bottles. Pick, pick what is worth fighting for and what's not. This is that time where you guys need to stand up for yourself and tell yourself, you know what? I've been down this road too many times before. I've been down the same path. I don't want to go down the same path anymore. I don't want to go down the same battle anymore. I need, I need to get away from it. 
there's more out there for you. There's better out there for you. But as long as you stay in that energy of feeling, you know, like the world is against you, you're not going to get past that, guys. There's a whole bunch of new things happening. There's a whole bunch of new offers, new positions. This could be a new position at work. This could be something to do with school or career. This could be a new relationship on the way. But again, if you stay in that five of cups energy where you can only see the bad right now, then how is the good going to come in? You know, you, you need to reframe your mind and you need to think about family. You need to think about love. You need to think about balance. This is, you know, breaking things down to the point where you know, you dot your eyes. This is some type of news on its way to you. And again, this, this has something to do with like work or relationship or something, something in the line of that. But Aquarius, like something new is trying to form here. Something new is coming through. But if you don't believe that you deserve it, then how do you expect it to come through? Right? Mel, can you turn it down a little bit more? Still really loud. Sorry, guys. I feel like this is a time where if you're not sure of your next move, if you're not sure of your next steps, then this is you putting yourself first. This is you taking so much needed time for yourself, some self-love, self-care. This is you shaping yourself to become who you want to become. You're going to eat dinner soon. No, you've had enough today. Sorry, guys. I honestly can't wait for school to be back. I'm finding it really hard to do any videos with the kids home because they're constantly around. <laughs> so bear with me as I try and get these readings done. But with the Queen of Wands, I feel like what Spirit in the Universe is trying to say for me is that you guys need to go out and do something that makes you happy. Instead of staying in this energy, again, the Five of Swords energy, the Hermit energy, the Five of Cups energy, when you're feeling like you're just not yourselves, like you need to do something that's going to make you happy, that's going to make you smile. You know, not stay in this energy of feeling like nothing is going to happen for you because I feel like that is what's going to keep you from getting these new abundances that are coming through. This is a time right now for you guys to move forward with the eight of wands. This is that new journey that's coming through. It's here. It's been here. And if you haven't seen it yet, that's because you can't let go of the past. Let go of the past and see the things coming in. Let go of people that no longer serve you and, and see things coming in. Um, this is that moment where maybe you just got to sit back and realize how far you've come. Maybe you're not where you always wanted to be or where you want it to want to be, but maybe where you want to be, you have more lessons and tests to go through. So this is about, you know, taking that step back and seeing just how far you've come in a short period of time, even like three months, six months to a year, right? This, this is about checking in right now with yourself. There is new love coming through for those Aquarius who are single. There is a new love opportunity coming through. Things are unfolding, but you guys have to have faith, you know? divine timing right this is time to celebrate let loose have fun go out, hang out with your girlfriends hang out with your guy friends you know you have overflowing abundances coming why can't you guys see that why can't you guys see the good things coming through why are you focusing so much on the bad things we've got clarity coming there's a breakthrough coming this is those aha moments that you've been waiting for something is going to happen with you aquarius and you know, if you're not on the same page with spirit, if you're not on the same page with the universe, then you're going to miss out on that opportunity, right? So let's get some oracle cards for you. As is my daughter. <laughs> Okay, it's not only about being right. In all tests of character, when two viewpoints are pitted against each other and the final analysts 
The thing that will strike you the most is not who was right or wrong, strong or weak, wise or foolish, but who went to the greater length in considering the other's perspective. Don't you agree, the universe? You're being watched by loving eyes. What if you're actually an ancient gladiator of love and joy who agreed to visit Earth during these primary years to spark some new thinking, share a few smiles, and help others discover they are too or awesome? Just saying, universe. P.S. Up for a joyce, of course, with rubber thingies. And we'll do one more. Enjoy your extraordinary uniqueness. Do you know what you're created, what you've created? No, besides an intergalactically, that was a really weird word, known Saturn named after you, inspiration in the eyes that have watched you, hope in the minds that have admired you, and love in the hearts that have known you. But you might ease up on your sachet before someone gets hurt. Not bad, kiddo. Not bad at all. There you go, Aquarius. That's what I have for you for July 16th to the 30th. If you would like a personal, all my information will be up above. No, I'm sending you guys all love and light. I hope you have a safe second half of July, and I will see you guys August 1st. Take care.